हेलो फ्रेंड्स हाउ आर यू दिस इज डॉक्टर श्री नागी आयुर्वेद एंड मेडिसिन डॉक्टर एंड ऑल्सो ईशा हटा योगा टीचर सो टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट डाइजेस्टिव फायर दैट इज ऑल्सो नोन एज इन आयुर्वेदा जाठर अग्नि एंड वट्स द रिलेशनशिप बिटवीन जाठर अग्नि एंड इम्यूनिटी और डाइजेस्टिव फायर एंड इम्यूनिटी एंड हाउ बाई स्ट्रेंथनिंग योर डाइजेस्टिव फायर यू कैन मेक योर इम्यूनिटी स्ट्रॉन्ग बाई यूजिंग सर्टन स्मॉल टिप्स दैट्स बीन मैंशन इन आयुर्वेदा फॉर योर डे टू डे लाइफ एंड दैट विल मेक योर इम्यूनिटी स्ट्रॉन्ग बिकॉज द टाइम Uh, from which we are going right now it's a very difficult time because whole world is suffering from corona so whatever uh, small things which we can incorporate in our life in our daily regime in our daily day to day life and which will be helpful for your immunity we should try to include it in our day to day life and we should work towards enhancing our immunity in ayurveda a lot of uh, importance has given to the small things like how we eat what we eat how to eat how to sit uh, in uh, in addition to this how to drink water when to drink water after food or before food these kind of small things makes a lot of difference uh, so i thought let's uh, share all the small tips uh, that's been mentioned in ayurveda that will be helpful for all of us during this difficult times to enhance your digestive fire and ultimately your immunity because a person who has good digestive fire his immunity will also be good uh, there is a very direct relation between the immunity and your digestive fire or jatar agni in ayurveda there is also a concept like if you have good digestive fire means your food is digested properly and ultimately the all these seven dhatus from which our body is made up of that is ras rakt maas med asthi majja shukra all these tissue be various kind of tissue levels they will be strong and ultimately your immunity that is known as ojas that will be much better so let's see what are the small things that we can do in our day to day life to enhance the immunity and make our life better so that our body will gain natural immunity uh, so uh, first thing what we are going to talk about is uh, food whenever we are uh, how we should eat food what is the way to eat food that will help us uh, to gain strength so in ayurveda there is a procedure called achman uh, achman is nothing some big science is very small thing like you have seen uh, when there is a big fire is going up or where uh, in general when somewhere uh, there is fire on and if we put little bit water in it you know the fire becomes like this just water uh, act as a catalyst similarly when uh, immediately before sitting uh, for food if you are going to have food uh, immediately before if you take one sip of water in your mouth if you just have one sip of water that will enhance your digestive fire and if you drink one sip of water one thing it will uh, clear all the impurities that are present in your throat because whenever we you know we breathe uh, various kind of organisms get, get Uh, through our nostrils in our uh, respiratory system and you know this many times they got uh, they got stuck in our throat sometimes even mucus so when you do one achman all everything will go to the uh, stomach it will not go into your respiratory system so immediately before food what you do you take one sip of water after that you have your food uh, it's best to have cooked meals and warm meals uh, don't take that meal which is uh, very cold and which is not freshly prepared because that is not uh, good for your health if you keep food for long uh, after cooking it will start losing its nutritional value uh, so in ayurveda a lot of importance has been given or a lot of emphasis has been given uh, to have a meal which is freshly cooked so anyway a whole world is sitting in a home during lockdown and so it's better that you cook yourself and you try to have freshly cooked meals that will be very helpful uh, for your body to enhance your immunity uh, remember like i said uh, you have to take only sip of water don't do these things if you are like even thirsty and you are drinking one glass or two glasses of water immediately before food or even half hour before food you should not take one uh, full glass of water half an hour before food 
because that will reduces your digestive fire. Many times this happens like if we are thirsty or if we have come from somewhere and uh, for example, we are going to have food after one hour. Uh, we mostly do these things like we go to the kitchen and we drink three, four glasses of water and after that, uh, after half an hour, we are going to have food. So don't do these things. If you want to have water, you can have water mm -hmm. one hour before, but don't take water uh, exactly before 40 minutes or 20, half an hour before food because that will reduce your digestive fire. And if your digestive fire will be reduced, then it will result into indigestion that next day you will feel the food is not digested properly and uh, unnecessarily you will feel burps. Uh, in the stomach and you feel some kind of unpleasant feeling. So you can avoid it if you drink water properly.